The Skateboard Watchtower Movie Review is brought to you by... Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome to Skateboard Watchtower Movie Review. Movie Review. And what are we reviewing today? You know what? You're almost there. You're almost famous. famous. <laughs> yeah, almost famous. Oh, Kate Hudson on the front cover with a bunch. Back in the 60s and the 70s, how they got her done. So, all right, well, I got to this another one you told me about. Yeah. And yeah. I went and watched it. And it was, I got to say, it was an interesting movie for, from the fact of Crow, who actually went out with several bands at the age of 15 for Rolling Stone and, and just watching and writing about different bands, there's five of them, and I can't, Pac, uh, Paco, uh, the Eagles, Pogo, and, yeah, Pogo, uh, yeah, Pogo, Pogo, the Eagles, Eagles Almond Brothers, Brothers, and Led Zeppelin, there's was Zeppelin, there's one more, I and I think it David Bowie, I think actually, I can't he, what the, those were. but it's about him, and, and, I like those stories, I like the, it's not autobiographical, and he'll no, even tell you it's no. not autobiographical, it's more, it's something that he wrote, yeah, based on based his on, life, on his life, and he, directed it. And, and I think he did a great job. I mean, actually, he did a great job. You know, I told you I was going to bash it. <laughs> just, just, just to watch you. Just, what? I like him. No, no, man. Okay, I won't tell you. I did like it. And, and I'm going to tell you why. The band, because in the, in the movie, he follow, he, he's supposed to go do a, a thing a, for a, a Black Sabbath. A 3,000 uh, 3, word. Was 3,000 word? Yeah, 3,000 uh, word for, article for, for, on, for Black, Black Sabbath. Sabbath. But they wouldn't let him get into the thing. So a group shows up, a band shows up called Stillwater. Stillwater. Now, before anybody gets upset or anything, but no, this isn't the actual Stillwater band. In fact, they had to go get permission from Stillwater to use their name for yeah, this yeah, band. Yeah, yeah, uh, If you don't know who Stillwater is, I give one song for you to go listen to, and you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. It's called Mindbender. You'll, 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 you'll ask that yeah, song. Yeah. Uh, but... They used the, the in the group that they're called Stillwater. Stillwater, and what it's about it's about these what well, they call them band aids, but it's girls. The group is what well, don't call us groupies, but yeah, 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 we yeah. we're band aids. It's groupies, we help out with, it's groupies. But uh, Kate Hudson, uh, is, is she she does do such an amazing job for her character for her character because she I mean, developed it more than yeah, it's on this the page, was, um, and it blew my mind how she was able to transition into that. Yes, yes. Uh, from, from some of the stuff that I have seen at the other movies where she's been into. Yes, yes. Um, and because she goes from, from a joy, happy, go-lucky person to you see the, the, the drama and you see the, the hurt and everything that happens in it. Yes, yes. And then you see her solve the problem at the end. Yes, yes. With, with and I problem. like how... Her last, F, her last act as a band aid was to fix that problem. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and I'm not giving that away. Yeah, we're not, not, going, away yeah, we're not here to give things away. You have to go watch it. It's called Almost Famous, and it's actually got her on it. But it's not actually about her. It's about the 15 year old kid. And I can't remember. And that's the name. thing. I mean, he does such does a great job as he writes he, so well. And you know? he, he's above his years, but I like the little gag that's <laughs> played on him, which. 
if if she'd have done something like that, to you, your mom had done something like that to you, would you? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, don't do drugs. Don't take drugs. Well, you know, all kind of she, little stuff. So but the biggest thing, yeah. Uh, okay, it's got. Uh, I cannot think. Of what Francis her name is. something. Francis uh, McDermott. Yeah, Francis, Francis McDermott. McDermott. And I love her. I love her. Fargo. Love her, yeah, she's in Fargo. <laughs> and some other stuff. You mentioned Francis McDermott's Fargo. Yeah. <laughs> and, and she plays just over the top mom. Over the, uh, I'll say She over, flips out over bringing home she, Simon and Garfunkel. Yeah, she's pretty much outlawed anything fun for, for, for kids. Yeah, stuff. like she's very cynical. And it's got Zoe, uh, Zoe Deschanel in it, who plays... The daughter, of course, she does, does great. Yeah, yeah, she does a great job. Yeah. Uh, and then I mean, it's got an all-star cast. And uh, I mean, I love their Phillip, lead singer, uh, Jason Phillip, Lee. Jason Lee, which does doesn't sing, but he actually, actually he does sing. No, That's he actually, does because of, like, I went to check. They said really? Because he, yeah. he does a damn good job. Well, they they do good lip sync. That's why I say because I said I said no, Jason Lee. Not, not. Now I could be wrong. If I'm wrong, then put the comments there. Because I've heard Lark that they practiced friend, together said, and tried said to actually it was, be. Uh, wasn't him, so he can't sing worth the lick. So that's that was. My thought. And but at the same time, uh, it's the first time I'd seen him actually do a dramatic piece versus well, uh, the stuff so, with yeah. Ke- Kevin. My Smith. name's Earl. That and stuff with Kevin Smith and stuff. Yeah, yeah I mean, he's, uh, but I'm at Pete Townsend. Then. Philip, Philip uh, Seymour Hoffman. Philip, Philip Seymour Hoffman does a great Pretty job, tough. and he actually plays a character that really existed too. Um, <laughs> it's, I just love that. He's like, "What are you writing on? Uh, I'm writing about stuff. That kid's on drugs. <laughs> 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 he hangs up on it. It's funny got movie. moments of humor. It's got moments of sadness. The soundtrack itself is worth the soundtrack. Down. Down. If you like 60s and 70s music, and, that soundtrack is I mean, awesome. And, and also, I love the music that they created for the band of Stillwater. I mean, go look that up. Like, that's actually really good. Yeah. But um, I like how they also show, and this isn't really giving anything away, but I like how they show a band growing from a tour bus that's constantly to, bringing to the down plane. to the plane. <laughs> <laughs> and them hate, and they yeah. had to do a reference to this, and I thought, and I laughed my butt off when they rest of these. The minute they start going into turbulence, they start singing Peggy Sue, and I'm like, <laughs> yeah. but you asshole. Here's the thing about because well, I mean, Stillwater is taken from five different from five different bands. Yeah, there's five different so bands. Everything in, is, is from different things. So and you see something different, but I'm gonna when you see everything from from the, the stage to backstage. To the Front hotel stage. Rooms. And I mean, this kid, you know, they thought he right all. He He's what he did. You and know, I mean, he first, went from just being, oh, just a critical writer to befriending this man. And, 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 and I love how they call because oh, it's the enemy. It's he's the, a critic. He's and he goes from the enemy to being, uh, you know, one of the And how, like, they do their little chant right before they go on stage to kind of calm themselves down. They grab him and throw him in. And I mean, it's, you know. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's. It's your typical rock and roll, mm-hmm. sex, drugs, and rock and roll fun. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but, but also, you also see where... Don't take drugs! The character... The characters, that they're, so base, cool. the characters that they're basing this band on are real characters in the sense of just the way they look and how they act. Because, I mean... You just have to pick them out who you think they are. From I'm going to tell you one, though. Russell Hammond has got to be Dickie Betts. Because he looked like Dickie Betts from Almond Brothers. Because if you looked the way he looked, he looked a lot like him. I don't know, I kind of figured out somebody from the Eagles, but... Uh, yeah, Glenn so, Fry. Uh, so, uh, I mean, it was, it's kind of hard to say. Yeah, it's hard to say, but I mean, that's the thing. Up, you but look that's at the whole thing. It makes you think, but... But, yeah. you might, okay, but I mean, each one, like I said, each one is and designed off of somebody. So. I like... And even even uh, Penny Lane, who's... who's yeah, I mean, that, trades, yeah. He was... was and, and she keeps giving different like, names too, so yeah. and that was always. But funny. they think that they come from. Uh, I can't think what her name is as well. But I don't know. Go watch the movie. Pull up. Um, See, that's what I did. I did the reason I wanted to pull up some of the stuff just before I came. That's the last one I said. I said did Jason Lee actually sing the thing? He said no. Jason Lee couldn't sing for <laughs> a thing, so they actually lip synced. Now, if he did sing, anybody's gay. Yeah. Please write in the comments. And there, I mean, and that's let us know. And it's another. Sometimes you never know what the sources that you look up on the internet. You don't know what the who the boy is. And stuff, another so. thing I like about it is, but I do like just Jason Lee. 
Oh, he's great, great at it. Oh yeah, I, I like. This is another one of those movies kind of like Super 8. I love the production design and the links that it went to to look like New York in the 1970s, um, Arkansas, the South. <laughs> California, Cleveland, I mean, Cleveland, uh, Cleveland uh, Alabama, uh, I mean, Tennessee, all the places. I mean, and the way that they show the planes this, and the buses, the planes, the buses, the cars. I mean, the the costuming, the guitars, the instruments themselves. Uh, Everything was good. And actually, I figured this out and looked this up. This is another thing. When Russell gets shocked, oh stage, yeah, that's actually taken from Creed School Art Revival at uh, Woodstock. They were at Woodstock. You can look it up. But John got shocked several times by the microphone. <laughs> so they took that from that. Well, that I mean, the, they won't put that in there unless they don't get it. Yeah. But if you love Kate Hudson, any type of acting, and you, you're going to love her in this. She does a great job in it. Oh, and yeah. I didn't recognize her first. Oh, no. I up. mean, she's completely... Oh, yeah. so, and it also... You also had... Uh, um, there was another girl in Bob there that... She, yeah. Which you know from the craft and uh yeah. Waterboy. Uh, yeah. Uh, and she also did she part. did the um uh Island of Dr. Paul, Moreau remake. Island, yeah, and then you got Polly Perrette's got a little place yeah, in there. Yeah. Don't know Polly Perrette, she's in CIS played uh Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah I forgot her name now. But and I mean that's the CIS, thing, I mean uh, they do like there's so many of these young guys. Yeah. Townsie. Todd Rundgren. Todd Rundgren was actually in there. Uh Peter Frampton. Yeah. Peter, yeah. yeah, Peter Frampton Peter, actually was the guitar coach. Yeah. Peter Frampton. So, uh, and he was actually playing himself in Humble Pie. Yeah. <laughs> he was actually yeah, playing that's, himself that's in Humble Pie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, I mean, and that's the thing. And that's the thing. Uh, I, I love how the story develops, and it's not just a... Where did that come up with? Well, you said the word Pete and Peter. That, I mean, that's got the same first thing. Because I'm like, where is Pete Townsend in this movie? But, um, Frampton. Frampton. P Peter Frampton. But the thing with it is, it's a coming of age story. It really is at heart. It is. And also. But you got to see, too, he had to overcome the things of his mom. I mean, she true that. Said, true not, that. But that's one thing that you, you, you have to go and look into the special. Uh, features features to find out and they sit there and they listen and saw it's called stairway and i think it's stairway to heaven you can't actually hear it but they're sitting there and you can't hear none of the music or anything and she like listening to it and, and then she finally gets up and says okay you got permission to go and blah blah but you got four days yeah which turned into like a year <laughs> <laughs> like a year so yeah so and all right so like I said I don't want to be going into more to yeah yeah yeah, yeah 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 we need to uh, like I said it's got a great all star cast in tour yes, it's got yes great entertainment so on one to five for entertainment I'm gonna give it a five on entertainment because it does draw you in you did five just because I love the music the yeah, entertainment on it. once you get the Creedence I had Creedence Clearwater revivals on I mean it's got it all kinds Skinner songs for songs, Woo! Uh, like Brothers. I said, I mean, you can actually just put the movie on, and you'll just be listening to the music, the music and just, uh, just to hear the music. Uh, all right, so I'm gonna give it five as well, except for that. So now, accuracy. As far as accuracy, I'm gonna give it a five on how close they tried to get. The I'm gonna give it a four. For the simple fact is, it wasn't exactly accurate. I think it could have been a little bit more accurate on some of the the, the things as far as. As far as some of the, the details that they could take it to, they cut some stuff out, and I understand. Yeah, I understand. You got you got the. If you and I, I'm going to tell you this the, as a your, filmmaker, your and I know where he's coming from on this. Your, your, you, you'll have a scene, and it'll look great, and it's your favorite scene in the whole movie. But by the time you get to the cutting room and you're cutting things in, your odds are you're probably cutting that scene out. You're cutting the scene, and here's the thing about that. that and the reason why most of them because you have you know you got the central police and they look at it they're gonna say yeah and that's that one piece can be the whole thing ties in yes thing yes yes and sometimes look like I said I can't actually blame that on the movie no no but like I said I think they could have went with just a little bit more with the grit with well I won't say with not just with the grit but as far as having 
Um, it's more of the actual. I mean, they had you. You heard Ozzy Osbourne mention some of these other, but you never. That, that, get, that, 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 I get where you're saying you that. Get to see you hear about the bands, but you never they see, get the, to full see bands. the full band. So it'd be a little bit, be a little bit more. And it's kind of like, yeah, okay. Be, and yeah, I think what they were trying to say is, this isn't about these other bands. This is about this one man, and we're trying not to overshadow. Well, I don't that. think it would overshadow. Fact, I don't think so. it would either, but I think but that's what they were going through. Yeah, yeah, so that's why I give them four. They could have been a little bit more, a little bit more. Things. I'm gonna as far as popcorn, one day, and I'm gonna give it a ten. I'm gonna give it a ten because I saw this when it came out. Uh huh. I saw it when it came out, and I saw the theaters, and I really, really uh -huh. liked it. I thought it I didn't see it did. I just watched I, um, it a couple days ago. It influenced me say. as when I was my younger youth, I. Was a guitar player, it's, and so it inspired me to look into. I'm gonna say I'm gonna give it a, a ten because I said it's very entertaining. Thing. And so oh, for so my host, for myself, Bill McCoy, Nick Revis, Nick Revis, love, love peace and chicken, chicken grease. grease.